Flip, body, crib, got it, drive on it Did I ever, all I ever asked was you to pick up the phone when you were alone All I ever asked was you to show me some love, kisses and hugs No, I never had an issue, go to the club with your boys, baby I never wanted you to stay too long, just wanted you to show me up. So won't you say my name, say my name Hello Pisces, so this is going to be your reading about your person, okay? So, let's start with the tarot. The angle might be a little bit off. I'm going to test this angle to see if it's good without showing the tripod. Okay, so let's start with the tarot. Universe, what's the current energy? Okay. Universe, what's the current energy between Pisces and the person that's on Pisces' mind? Universe, what's the current energy? Universe, what's the current energy? Universe, what's the current energy? The Emperor. Ooh, okay. Let's see what, what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that's on Pisces' mind. What this person like to say to Pisces? Universe, person that's on Pisces mind. What would this person like to say to Pisces? Universe, person that's on Pisces mind. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> universe, person that's on Pisces mind. What is this person? Um, universe, person that's on Pisces mind. What is this person keeping hidden from Pisces? Universe, person that's on Pisces mind. What is this person keeping hidden from Pisces? Okay. Universe, person that's on Pisces mind. How does this person feel about Pisces? Universe, person that's on Pisces mind. What is this person's true feelings for Pisces? Universe, person that's on Pisces mind. What is this person's intentions with Pisces? Universe, person that's on Pisces mind. What actions will this person take with Pisces? Ooh, I got two cards that want to come up. Got the Eight of Wands, Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Jenna Energy, King of Pentacles. A lot of you guys are dealing with Taurus, Aries, Virgo. Okay. Um, current energy is the Emperor. You got someone who really know what they want and they want you. Okay. Um, this is someone who might be older than you. Um, this is someone who's really in their divine masculine. This is the Emperor. The Emperor is a counterpart of the Empress. So this is someone who's looking to be in a serious relationship. They know your worth. This is great, okay? Now, this could also be you. So even though you're a feminine, this could be you. Like, you're not settling for anybody. This person has to be at your level. This person has to be serious, okay? Now, what would this person like to say to you? Ace of Cups. So I feel like this is like a newer connection or someone that you're going to meet very soon. Um, this is someone who's going to be very affectionate um, at the beginning. Someone who's going to express themselves emotionally at the beginning too. Okay. Now, what are they keeping hidden? Knight of Swords. Okay. So this can go both ways. So my second initial um, feeling with the Knight of Swords is, I'm going to start with the second initial feeling. Well, it's not initial. The second feeling that I got. This person could talk a lot. <laughs> talk a lot about themselves. Talk a lot. So some of you guys are dealing with Aries. But this is someone who might talk a lot. And if you're very busy, you may feel like, oh, this is too much. Okay. Now, my initial feeling is that this is someone with the Knight of Swords initially. I'm trying to remember what I got initially. Um, this could be someone who is very direct very very direct um but they could be some time like how can i say this this could be someone that can be they say what's on their mind without like processing it okay now how does how does this person feel about you, you got the two pentacles they feel like you're not as interested in them okay they also feel like you may give them mixed signals um they feel like they don't really know if you really like them like that, okay? Um, 
True feelings, seven of wands. This is someone who want to fight for this connection or fight for this possibility for this to turn into a relationship or connection, okay? They're going to be very persistent, okay? So this could be a cardinal sign, Aries with some Libra in their chart, um, Virgo with some Libra in their chart. They're going to be very persistent of wanting to be with you. Now, their intentions is the hermit, okay? I feel like their intentions is not to appear too thirsty, but you may at times feel like they're a little bit too thirsty they a little bit on you too much okay i'm gonna clarify some more though now their action is ace of pentacles in reverse and eight of wands okay they're still gonna try with you with the eight of wands being there it's about action fast action right in reverse um with the ace of pentacles in reverse they can still try even though they may feel like you may turn them down they see themselves as a catch that's what i'm getting here with that ace of pentacles being reversed they may feel like it's a missed opportunity if you don't take the take their offer okay but they're still gonna try okay i feel like this is someone who have a lot to offer okay a lot to offer let's clarify universe clarify the hermit universe clarify the hermit seven of pentacles so their intention is to invest in this okay this look good i'm gonna clarify this but this looks Look good. You have a seven pentacles. Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, they interested. Like they really invested. They really want to be in a relationship with you. They're serious. I feel like you might meet this person at work. Like either like when you're about to get your coffee. For some reason, I'm in the mall. So some of you guys may work in the mall, but they're serious they're serious let's see what else i'm getting universe got by the ace of pentacles in the verse and the eight of wands ten of wands yeah they're gonna see they're, they're still gonna try they're still gonna like put an effort even though they may feel like it's one way like you're not really showing too much interest okay hmm let's see what else i want to clarify let's clarify the nine of swords hold on Okay, universe, clarify the nine of swords. Okay, I've got a lot of cards. Six of wands. Seven of cups in reverse and the death in reverse. Universe, clarify six of wands. Seven of cups in reverse and the, de and the death card in reverse. Two, um, page of wands. Something about the, what they're going to talk about in their past. Okay. Yeah, they're going to be really upfront. They'll be upfront, blunt. Talk about their good, their, their, like, um, how can I say? We're going to talk about their good characteristics, but also their bad characteristics when you get to, um, date them. Okay. Let's just say this is someone that's really on you, but you haven't taken the shot to date them. When you guys actually go on a date, they're going to express their good side and their bad side. Okay. Universe, clarify, um, the emperor. Universe, clarify the emperor the tower oh okay when i have that combination it didn't came out together okay but usually when i get emperor and the tower together this is someone who's very controlling but they're very powerful at the same time now it didn't came out together but when i clarify i got the tower so i do see they do have like a negative side of wanting to control everything wanting things to be their way i do see that is in the background okay now let's look at the ace of cups Universe, clarify the Ace of Cups. Nine of Swords, yeah, they really want you. They want you. <laughs> They're not going to stop. They're going to keep persisting, even though you may not give them no sign that you want them or that you're really interested, okay? So you got someone that really want you, okay? Um, this person is going to be someone who have Aries, probably Libra in their chart. Um, Virgo with Libra in their chart. Um... It could be also Taurus with a lot of earth coming here. Okay. So let's look at the advice. What advice do they have for you guys? Okay. Let's see. Universe, give me a four card spread. What advice do you have for Pisces when it comes to this? Universe, give me three more cards. What advice do you have? I got too many cards. Okay, this card I want to come out. We got compassion. Universe, let me through my cards. What advice do you have for Pisces? Universe, let me through my cards. What advice do you have for Pisces? 
universe give me one more card okay so jenna energy is bravery there is also healing there is give celebrate and open up yeah so i do see that this person have a lot to offer okay with that gift card coming out it just told me like they have a lot to offer like this is a time like let's just say in previous connections most recently or way back um if you had a pattern of dealing with people that was selfish that did not want to give that's not the case anymore i feel like doors of doors of love and doors of like receiving is happening right now okay um then I got a celebration. This is again someone who see your worth. This is gonna be someone who's gonna be showing you around, not because like you're a trophy or not because like you know how you look. It's more so like this is what they want out of a person, out of their partner. Like you're exactly what they want. Okay. Um, they want you to open up, and then there is healing. And then there is bravery okay so what i'm getting here with the advice is trying to say like if you do meet someone like this um it's trying to say see see if their words match your action if their words do match your action you know try to really get to know them okay listen to your intuition but try to get to know them so that's the advice okay so let's look at um the statements for these cards so bravery you're being asked to make a tough decision that you've been putting off because of fear, which is understandable. But you do have the strength and bravery to make the decision and you will feel so much lighter when you do. Healing. Um, your body, mind, and soul are in a period of deep healing right now. You're going through many transformations at once and you're being asked to allow yourself to receive the healing you need with open arms and open heart. Give. One of the best feelings we can experience is giving to others. And when we do so, we feel lifted up and our lives improve greatly because of someone else's happiness. Think of one way you can give to another today. Celebrate. You're being asked to celebrate a recent accomplishment, no matter how big or small. Do something special um, to commemorate the moment. You deserve that and so much more. And then there's open, open up. You're being asked to open your heart to another to um, let down your walls and trust that they want what's best for you. Your life will open up in wonderful ways once you decide to open up. Okay, so that's the reading that I have for you Pisces. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing.